is which color wire is recommended for earth connection as per ISI standard. Okay, from ISI standard code visit. We will see the earth connection in the color of wires. So, this is a simple idea question. We will easily answer the earth. So, we will see the black, green, red, and blue. Okay, so we will start with the face wires. So, the face wires are normally the R, Y, B. We will see the face wires. This stands for red, yellow, blue. So, we will cancel the options. Red wala, blue wala, ini, nama kita Earth connection ni karena nama red color, blue color ini adalah face yang nama kita use ini. Next ini adalah neutral ini, le. Neutral ini wires color ini adalah ikim normally black color ini ikim ini nama kita use ia neutral use ia. Agi ini adalah black nama kita option cancel itu. Ini adalah black is for neutral. So finally left over ini adalah option mana green color. So ini pernah it is called as earth connection, earth wire light we are using that is green color wires we are using as per ISI code so what is ISI code recommend color wires are green color is for our earth connection ok, clear right and then we are going to ask simple question just to ask careful right and then you can answer clear right and pick a number ok, next one we are going to ask Application base is DC generator preferred for charging automobile batteries is That is, what DC generator is automobile charging We use use the options are shunt generator, series generator, long shunt generator, short shunt compound generator From this generator set, what generator is now, we use charging applications. What is the question? Now, generally, we use DC generators. We use different types of generators. We use different types of generators. We use different types of applications. Now, we have to answer this question. What is the answer? What is the charging application? Charging is a constant voltage. It is not a fluctuation. What is the constant voltage offer? Generator is the answer. That is, shunt generator. Constant voltage, the terminal voltage is not dipped, it is almost constant to maintain the shunt generator. So, DC generator preferred for charging application, the charging application preferred for kind of generator is shunt generator. Series generator is booster applications, what do you use? We use the series generator, the series generator is long shunt, short shunt. Okay, so we have option that is shunt generator and we use charging automobile batteries. Clear right and done. Next question is to move on. Question number 8. Which of the following electric quantity can you measure with a moving coil instrument? That is moving coil instrument. Moving coil instrument use either the electrical quantity and measure the electrical quantity means voltage current. So, that is the DC current and DC voltage. Options are the DC AC currents. Next, AC voltage, AC current. This is the measure of electrical quantity measure the moving coil instrument. So, this is the measurements topic. Measurements is the question. For moving coil instrument, we call it MC instrument. That is permanent magnet moving coil. PMMC instrument is the moving coil instrument. For permanent magnet, we use it. That is why the PMMC measure is the average value. That is why we get the average value. So, what is the measure? What is the measure? DC quantity आना, DC quantity आना आरे तेरे ने moving coil instrument दे, so moving coil instrument measures the electric quantity as DC quantity. Okay, ना तो वैरी ने दाना DC current दम DC voltage, अपन दाना DC current दे मेशरे ने इंगले दाना MC ammeters use ये, voltmeter आने इंगले दाना ये पर ये ना बोले DC voltage measure. That is the option A. Correct. 
Next, DC and AC currents. DC measure in, AC measure in. Apam, angin terus ada instrumen ni dana. That is, MI instrument, moving iron instrument dana. End measure in, DC, AC current measure in. Apam, option B ella. Now, next to naka, C. And then, AC matra measure in. Apam, end dana. Ipar in wala, AC measure in, namuk end dana, MI, UCM. Baksh, MI end dana, rendah measure in. Apam, end dana, C ella. AC current ada ke D wala. Nama kita correct option dana. That is DC current and DC voltage dana. Inda moving coil instrument da use ieda measure in na electrical quantity. Okay, clear right inda ni jadi. Kalau basic questions ana, just untuk sahaja sih kerja ni, satu mistake tu lada crack ya mete. Okay, next inda na which instrument is used to measure the ripple voltage. Apa ieda instrument dana? Ripple voltage measure ia mesti use ini tu. Ini adalah mana question. Okay, option yang kedua multimeter in voltage range. CRO, AC voltmeter, DC voltmeter. Pada mana ini ripple voltage ni adalah mana? Pih ripple voltage ni orang ini bawa. Nampaknya mana? Ipa orang ini boleh conversion sih naik tu berana. Ini mana? AC ni DC ini convert ini bawa. Berana ini mana? Nampaknya capacitor kita use ini tu. Ini mana? Filtering action je ini. Filtering action je ini bawa. Still ini mana? Oru ripple anda, a voltage ni le, oru ripple anda. Apa am ripple voltage measure iya mende use iya na instrument ini na at ay da ana ay da lada. Apa multimeter first option ini voltage range na. Apa multimeter ni orang mende normal nama voltage ni sebab ni le current, current alam dana. Ipa re na ini dana resistance measure iya. Angin je karya ngal kana ini multimeter use iya. Pih ripple voltage ni dana multimeter onda na aku measure iya betul la. Pini ni dana AC voltmeter onda betul la. DC volt meter orang tu betul la. Tapi yang mana ni CRO? CRO ni orang yang tu cathode ray oscilloscope. Pem cathode ray oscilloscope paling ni CRO use ini tu. Nampak ni dia macam wave form nampak plot dia macam once wave form nampak plot ini tu kerja ni. Adanya division si use ini ni mana ripple voltage ni calculate dia macam. Ini CRO ni advance dia tu beri mana DSO, Digital Oscilloscope, use it in the correct value, we measure the button in the correct value, we measure the correct value. So, we measure the CRO Cathode Ray Oscilloscope, use it in the measure of ripple voltage. Okay, clear right in the direction. Next question, let's move on, 10th question. That is, what is the type of insulator used for holding the HT overhead conductor on Straight running of poles. That is, HT overhead conductor, straight running poles, hold the arm and use the insulator. So, again, this question is a power system question. Now, HT is high tension. Okay, next one. Next one. High tension is overhead conductor. Support the arm and use the insulator. Normally, insulator is an insulating action. Ayat, nama kita supporting tower and down. A supporting tower lalu, itu nama kita conductor ayat, transmission line connecti embam. Enda ana current flow ayat, diri kita ni, nampu insulator use ayat, ana nampu connecti ni. A insulator HT ni, ayat type of insulator ana use ayat. Enda lada ana question. Apa options ni, enda ana shackle insulator, pin type insulator, post insulator, adu boleh tu ni, enda ana stay insulator. Apa, ini ana options. Apa, ini ada orang ni, enda ni, enda ana high tension ni, voltage range ni, enda beran nalar tu. Pada low tension de range ni orang ini mana 0 to 1000 volt beri ana, ini de beri mana low tension de voltage range beri mana 0 to low tension LT ni itu nolanya LTS from 0 to 1000 ni orang ini mana 1 kilo volt ni ni kira. Panggilan orang ini high tension ni orang ini mana 1 to 11 kV beri ana, ini de beri mana HT, that is 1 means 1 kV ni orang ini desa. 1 kV to 11 kV beri ane itu high high tension beri ane. Apa ni perih ane high tension cable sini ada ni high tension conductor sini ada support dia ni hold dia ni use ni na insulator ni ada. Pih shackle insulator first options lu ada buat. Shackle insulators ni orang ni wherever there is a dead end ada ni sharp corners. So apa points ni ane ni use ni ya shackle insulators ni use ni ya. Pih ni beri ni ane post insulator ni ada. Post insulator ni orang ni low voltage range ni la beri ni. Pine itu nana stay insulator. Stay insulator itu orang ini nana. Iparinya stay wire raga connecti ya main di use ini nana. Orang insulator ane inda stay insulator. So generally, nama lu use ini nana pin type insulator ane inda use ini 
for high tension that is from 1 to 11 kV. 1 to 11 kV vara varunna voltage range ile ulla conductors ne support cheyan vendi use cheyunnaanu endha pin type insulators. Okay. Clear right endu nu vicharikkunnu. Ee pin type insulators ne aanu next endana extra tension nagath 11 to 33 kV vara varumbam endu use cheyane disc ennu parayna insulators ilotte move on cheyunne. Okay. Clear right endu nu vicharikkunnu. 